Hey everybody, welcome to easyliving.com. So today we're gonna talk about something that I was very curious about. And you know, we've been doing a lot of videos on shaving. Oh. And I wanted to know, what are they using, like men using, when they use the, uh, the brush to brush on the, uh, the shaving cream or whatever it is? Like in the old cowboy films. Yeah, exactly. The cut exactly. So I found out that it's actually called shaving soap. And what it is, it's almost like a bar soap. You get it in a little container, you get a little bit of water on it, put it in your brush, and it makes a foam, and you use that foam and you put it on your face. Now I'm saying to myself, well, this is going to dry out your face. This doesn't look like it. It looks like shaving cream is much easier to use, right? But in reality, this is actually a less messy way and a more hygienic way of shaving your face. One of the reasons why shaving soap is more hygienic is because it has disinfectant, which basically means that it keeps your skin cleaner and prevents your skin from breaking out. It also prevents your skin from drying out because it does have any alcohol in it which comes in the old shaving cans. Another reason why shaving soap is better, in my opinion, is that it's environmentally friendly. If you are a very green type of person, you don't have the CO2 canisters uh, with the shaving cream in it emitting yeah. toxins into the ozone layer. So just a bar of soap, as simple as that. Another benefit of shaving soap is it's a much better product than shaving cream. It's a lot richer, therefore it's a lot thicker. Now this means that it actually moisturizes your facial hair a lot better than shaving cream that comes in the can. The shaving cream in the can is very airy, so mm -hmm. it doesn't actually really soak into your skin and soften the hairs and therefore gives you a cleaner, softer and closer shave. And then you don't have to shave as often, even better. True. So Rob from Shaveology is going to show you how to shave your face with shaving soap using the correct tools. How to lather a shave soap by hand. Now I'm going to demonstrate how to lather a shaving soap directly in your hand. It's important to completely submerge or soak your shaving brush before you start. I'm using the Shia Moisture Shave Shave Brush available at Target for under $10. It appears to be an entry level badger brush. This is a cheap, readily available shave soap made by Vonderhagen that can be picked up at the grocery store or most drug stores. I've put it in a $2 ceramic container. Wet the top of your shave soap, or some shavers even like to submerge a shave soap for a minute or two before lathering. Swirl the brush vigorously on top in a circular motion for 30 seconds to a minute. This will load the brush. Once the bristles are loaded with soap, you can proceed to begin lathering directly in your palm. I prefer this method because I can get immediate feedback while lathering my soap. I can feel how hydrated it is and how slick and how cushioning. I find that slightly cupping my hand while I lather will help to better mix the cream. For instance, right now it's dry, so I'm going to incrementally add a little bit of water. A little water will go a long ways, so I'm just going to run my brush once underneath the running faucet. Because the mixing motion drives the cream down into the base of the brush, you might want to wring it out once or twice by pulling the bristles through your thumb and forefinger. Now you can begin mixing again and adding more water if necessary. It'll take a little bit of experience to figure out the correct soap to water ratio to build your lather. A good lather should resemble a meringue or Cool Whip and it'll have a nice sheen to it in your palm when it shines in the light. Although it's a lot more difficult using the old cutthroat, mm -hmm. I definitely enjoy using it because it's a much closer shave yeah. compared to say conventional razors or the clippers. So using something like shaving cream with the cutthroat is definitely going to work out for me. And you know it's scented so it actually leaves your face smelling fresh and that gives you more confidence. Alright we hope you enjoyed this video. We want to thank Rob again from Shaveology for that informative video. You're watching easyliving.com where you can find anything and everything lifestyle.